New York City is a bustling metropolis with endless things to see and do. From iconic landmarks to hidden gems, there's something for everyone in the city that never sleeps. While many travel vloggers have covered the most popular attractions, plenty of lesser-known activities offer unique experiences and insights into the city's rich history and culture. So get ready to explore some hidden gems and discover a new side of the Big Apple. In this vlog, we'll uncover some of the best things to do in New York that travel vloggers only sometimes tell you about. Explore the lives of New York's immigrant community at the Tenement Museum. The Tenement Museum is a historic site and museum located on the Lower East Side of Manhattan in New York City. It tells the stories of immigrant families who lived in a tenement building at 97 Orchard Street during the 19th and 20th centuries. Visitors can take guided tours of the building, which has been restored to its original state and see the cramped living quarters and learn about the lives of the people who called it home. The museum also offers a variety of educational programs and exhibits that explore the history and impact of immigration in the United States. It's a fascinating and unique way to experience a city's rich cultural heritage. Experience the High Line from a different perspective and Enjoy a peaceful stroll under the stars by walking the High Line at night. The High Line is a public park built in a former elevated railway line that runs through the Chelsea neighborhood of Manhattan. While it's a popular destination during the day, walking the High Line at night offers a different experience. The park is less crowded and the city lights create a beautiful and peaceful atmosphere. You can enjoy a leisurely stroll or sit and relax on one of the many benches along the way. The park is open until 10 p.m., so it's an excellent option for a post-dinner walk or a romantic evening outing. Walking the High Line at night is a unique and memorable way to experience the city. Escape the hustle and bustle of the city and explore the quaint and charming City Island, a hidden gem in the Bronx. City Island is a small island in the Bronx it feels like a New England fishing village. It's a great place to escape the crowds of Manhattan and enjoy a peaceful day of exploring. You can stroll along the waterfront, visit the local shops and galleries, and indulge in fresh seafood at one of the many restaurants. City Island also has several parks and nature reserves where you can hike, bike, or bird watch. It's an ideal destination for a day trip or weekend getaway and offers a unique glimpse into a different side of New York City. We are Travel Pug, your travel guide around the world. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and hit that notification bell to stay up to date on more videos here in Travel Pug. Escape the city heat and take a refreshing ferry ride to the Rockaways, a series of beach towns in Queens for a relaxing day at the beach. The Rockaways is a series of Queens, New York City beach towns. While there are several ways to get there, taking a ferry is a unique and enjoyable option. The ferry ride offers stunning city skyline views and a refreshing breeze on a hot summer day. Once you arrive, you can enjoy miles of sandy beaches, boardwalks, and surf shops. The Rockaways is also home to several bars and restaurants, making it a perfect spot for a beach day with friends or family. Taking a ferry to the Rockaways is convenient and fun to escape the city and enjoy a day at the beach. Transport yourself to medieval Europe and admire art and architecture from the Middle Ages at the Cloisters, a branch of the Metropolitan Museum of Art in Upper Manhattan. The Cloisters is a branch of the Metropolitan Museum of Art in Upper Manhattan that specializes in medieval art and architecture. The museum is housed in a building that was designed to resemble a medieval monastery, and its collections include over 5,000 works of art and artifacts from the Middle Ages. Visitors can admire illuminated manuscripts, sculptures, and tapestries, and explore the museum's gardens inspired by medieval designs. The Cloisters is a unique and fascinating museum that offers a glimpse into a bygone era and a different side of New York City. 
step inside the home of the legendary jazz musician Louis Armstrong and learn about his life and legacy at the Louis Armstrong House Museum in Queens. The Louis Armstrong House Museum is a historic site and museum located in the Corona neighborhood of Queens, New York City. It was the home of the legendary jazz musician Louis Armstrong and his wife Lucille from 1943 until he died in 1971. The museum offers guided tours of the house, which has been restored to its original state and features exhibits on Armstrong's life and career, including his music, personal artifacts, and photos. Visitors can see Armstrong's recording studio, practice room, and garden, and learn about his impact on American music and culture. The Louis Armstrong House Museum is a must-visit destination for jazz enthusiasts and anyone interested in the history of American music. Laugh out loud and enjoy an unforgettable night of comedy by attending a show at the legendary Comedy Cellar in Greenwich Village. The Comedy Cellar is a legendary comedy club in Greenwich Village, New York City and has been a fixture of the city's comedy scene since it opened in 1982 and has hosted many famous comedians including Chris Rock, Jerry Seinfeld, and Amy Schumer. The club features a lineup of comedians every night including up-and-coming talent and established performers. The Comedy Cellar is known for its intimate setting and lively atmosphere, making it a popular spot for locals and tourists. Attending a show at the Comedy Cellar is a must-do activity for anyone who loves comedy and wants to experience the city's vibrant entertainment scene. Satisfy your taste buds and explore the diverse and authentic cuisine of New York's Flushing Neighborhood Food Tour Flushing is a neighborhood in Queens, New York City, known for its diverse food scene. Taking a food tour of Flushing is a great way to explore the area and sample authentic cuisine worldwide. The tours typically include visits to local restaurants, food stalls, and markets, where you can try everything from Chinese dim sum to Korean barbecue to Mexican street food. You'll also learn about the history and culture of the neighborhood and get insider tips on where to find the best eats. A food tour off Flushing is a delicious and exciting way to experience the city's multiculturalism and culinary traditions. There you have it! Some of the best things to do in New York are exploring the Tenement Museum and taking a food tour off Flushing. Whether you're a first-time visitor or a seasoned New Yorker, these activities offer a unique and memorable way to experience the Big Apple so next time you're in New York, be sure to check out these hidden gems and add some excitement to your itinerary. Would you rather take a ferry to the Rockaways for a day at the beach or attend a comedy show at the Comedy Cellar for a night of laughter? Share with us in the comments below. We are Travel Pug, your guide and forever travel buddy. If you enjoyed and loved this video, hit that like button, subscribe and hit that notification bell to stay updated on all of our upcoming videos. Thanks for watching. Bye.